Hi everyone, Chow5 here. So this is a video I've been wanting to film, but I've had trouble getting the setup and everything to film it. Uh, but this is a birthday haul, K-pop birthday haul, so I'm only going to show K-pop related things I get. Um, this is really late, my birthday was in May, and I'm just now posting this, but I did want to show because these are wonderful things that were added to my collection, and I wanted to show them and just give an extra thank you to the people who gifted me these things and everything, my dear friends. So, um, yeah, we'll just get started. Um, the first gift I received, I actually tweeted about how my friend had sent a giant picture of Taemin on the packaging. Um, I would show you, but um, my address is also clearly displayed and I don't have a way of covering it without covering the Taemin picture. Um, but it was um, One of One Era Taemin, which is, you know, One of One Era is my favorite. So um, that was a nice touch by my friend, even if it did embarrass me with the postman. But she sent me a lot of, she sent me a card, beautiful card, um, it's personal so I won't be showing it. Um, and she also sh um, sent me lots of stickers and stationary things, which is very much appreciated. She does a lot of pen pal. Um, her at is laserdonut on Instagram and she does pen paling. And she's also very active on Amino. She like gets featured a lot for her DIY stuff. Um, so, as a gift, she sent me this charm, which hopefully I can show you. It's, it has the mon bebe symbol and then it says I love you all day, I love you always. It's supposed to be like a hotel key charm, you know? Like, I don't know what it's called exactly. On the back it says 514, I don't know if I'm showing it right, 514. Um, and it says mon bebe, a beautiful human who will always love and support Monster X no matter what. And then on the bottom MXMB, Monster X mon bebe. And then it has a blue heart charm. I don't think you can see it very well. I'm sorry, but it's very beautiful. Very beautiful. It has a heart um, star clasp. I've just been hanging it near my pins. <laughs> um, yes, this friend is a mom bebe. Um, we share a lot of fandoms actually. She's a multi just like me. Um, but this was a very sweet thing for her to gift me. I wasn't expecting it at all. And then she's very crafty. Like I mentioned, she does a lot of DIY stuff. She made me something. It is um, from Monster X's Tutak Gom. I think Ming Hyex is called Ming Gom. Correct me if I'm wrong. I think it's Ming Gom. She made me one. <laughs> so she made this herself out of felt and she added a cute bow on it. And his face is so cute. I don't have any Tutak Gom stuff. Um, I just haven't gotten around to getting any of it. Um, but this one's handmade by my friend. And the reason this one is so special is because she made it a cucumber. <laughs> so if you follow Monstax and if you follow Minhyuk, you know. <laughs> Hates these things. But it's so cute that um, she made me. It's just it's just really funny. And it's really cute. I love it so much. It's so cute. I don't know how to display him, but he's precious. So yes, that was from my friend. Um... And then the other gift I received was from my friend of Music and Love 05. She always outdoes herself. I try to spoil her because she deserves it. But then she does the same to me and it's like, ah. We finally stopped being like, stop, stop. We're finally like, okay, whatever. <laughs> I am very grateful. I'm very grateful she thinks of me and sends me. She doesn't have to, but she sent me a lot of stuff this year. Um, so I'm going to show all of it. She sent me two packages actually. So I one was... The, like the day of my birthday I think and then like a few days later the other one um so I'll just I don't remember the order I received everything but I'll just show everything first of all she sent me this um 10 new heroes inspired notebook it's grid lined it's on the front it's like this on the back like this and like I said it's just um grid lined on the inside and it came with a bunch of stickers also new heroes inspired love this because um she is one of the friends i went to see super m with so you know we saw new heroes live sitting side by side so it's very very special so there's this one yeah hold on i don't know how to show this one so they're all of 10 from new heroes which is a good era. I loved his hair and I loved the outfits he wore. Like this outfit, this sequin shirt, this one's the best. Love that one. 
and then this one is just text so yeah so that was really nice because you know I do like scrapbooking and journaling and I already have an idea for that one um, then she also sent me I guess I'll go with NCT stuff <laughs> she sent me this Hechen slogan I don't know the fan site or anything because I'm terrible like that but I lost the hold on here it is <laughs> so um she was going to sell this to me because she had bought it and then she like wanted to sell it and I was like I'll buy it off you but then she sent it to me for my birthday <laughs> so it says e dong hyak and it's orange and it has like persimmons or orange I don't know but it has an orange fruit there and this is the image here which I know this outfit from somewhere but I can't remember what I know I've seen it and I've seen fan cams of him in this but I do not remember what exactly so yeah, um, it came with these two stickers, they're super super cute, well just, it's him performing, so it's cute, and it came with this photo card, so yeah, it just says Hechan, boy who always shines brightly, brighter, brightly, that's all, that's all I can find from it, but yeah, that was so sweet of her, and I finally have an NCT slogan. Um, and then the other thing she sent me was <laughs> wild. <laughs> um, NCT One Two Seven Superhuman Vinyl Hechen's version. <laughs> I don't even have a way to play this. I don't even know how to store it. It's literally just on top of my binders right now because it's so big and I don't know where to put it. Um, but yeah, it is gorgeous. It's gorgeous. I love it so much. It's definitely beautiful for a display. Look, it's beautiful 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 here's the back and the track listing and credit info and everything I think these do actually play so now I'm like what if I get a player but also I would only have one thing to play on it but this is this is really surprising <laughs> she's so sweet um her bias is Hechen as well by the way and so it's it's even more heartwarming that she shares Hechen with me but like me she's like oh G21 <laughs> um okay other thing she sent me, um, this cup sleeve from a New East cup sleeve event. It was to celebrate their anniversary. So it says New East 0315. This place is our utopia. And it seems there's fan camps to Bet Bet and Blessing. Or maybe like the music video for Bet Bet. But yeah, but I don't know if you can see this good at all. But it's really cute. It has OT5 on there. Really cute. She said she got this from a friend who went to the event. And I'm really thankful because I love cup sleeves and it's New East um okay this is like the main thing um <laughs> I really want to show it because it's really really cool and I can't believe she got me this but it is from the Up Peach Kang, da Kang Daniel edition of the Cacao Friends store it is the <laughs> skater plush I don't know how to show this lighting's better it is the skater plush um the big plush because i had mentioned there were small ones that sold out immediately they actually did get restocked and then sold out again and i think they're back in stock um they've been really good about stocking it actually um and this one also continues twice i've seen it stocked and then out of stock but um a music and level five got one <laughs> I'm using her username just in case. I don't know. I have never asked her if she's okay with me using her name. <laughs> but um, this is the back of the box. It has a cute little comic of a peach finding a skateboard and falling in love with skateboarding. Um, it has these cute um, little details there. And it has an official sticker somewhere. I think it's on the plush actually. I will take it out to show you. First of all, this is super cool because it is the cutest out of all the uh, Peach Kang Dania plushes um, but also because it's skater and we all know Kang Dania loves skating he's a skater boy so um, this is like fake leather the helmet and it has this embroidery that says K Daniel and it has little straps and then he has this cross bag this cross fanny pack and it also says K Daniel in embroidery and the zipper actually works and this, this actually has like a strap you can disconnect. Um, and <laughs> yes, on the back he has his, his butt with a little embroidery. That this is Daniel drew this when he drew the design for the Up Peach. 
he drew that. And then there's this embroidery on the back of the helmet. Really precious. This is Daniel's drawing, by the way, that he made originally. And then there's also this skateboard and the wheels do move. It's like an actual little skateboard toy. And here it says, I can't really show you, but it says K. Daniel. And then again, his drawing. Really cute. Um, here is the tag. <laughs> it says Kang Daniel Edition. And on the back it has the Up Peach character. Really cute. Um, and it's so squishy. He is so, so squishy and so cuddly. This is literally the best quality plush ever. So cute. So it's even softer than the mini one. I have a mini one of him with the pink hoodie. This one's even softer. And it's super squishy and precious. And here is the tag. It also has a tag with Daniel pictured on it. He's hugging the big old pillow. There's like a big like beanbag pillow of it available too. Or maybe it's sold out by now. But here is a Peach Kang Daniel edition and the official connect entertainment sticker you can't really see it but it's his um entertainment company so yeah so this was the main gift and i'm shooketh but i'm really really grateful and it's really really precious and this is something i was kind of debating getting myself because i settled with the little one and then when the little skater one got restocked i wasn't fast enough so then um but i was like thinking like should i be checking amazon every day for when they put it again but she got it for me, which is so sweet. And thank you if you're watching. Um, yeah. Believe it or not, that's not even the last thing she sent me, though. <laughs> she did also send me a key birthday support bag. So it was like a little bag with a bunch of confetti and stuff. I can't find where I put it. But I have all the items from it here. Um, I think I have all the items. If I forgot some, sorry. But it came with these photo cards. This one's really cool because it's both matte and his image is glossy. I think this is from when he performed in Vietnam. I think. I'm pretty sure this is when he performed that song with um, other artists. And then the back says, Miracle Keeping Love. Again, I don't know what fan site or anything these are from at all. Miracle, I assume, is the name. Um, and it came with this button. It's so cute. And then it came with this one of the Story of Light. And this one, which is actually fan art. It's actually fan art of Key, and it's um, Keyland inspired. It's really small, so I don't know if I'll be able to show you it very well. Yeah, it's not turning, it's not coming up very clearly, but it's fan art, which is super gorgeous. And he's like doing a heart symbol, it's so cute. Um, and also these stickers. So it's Key with Comde and Garçon. Can you see that? There. I need to put stuff over here because here's where you can see it better. And then here's a Forever Yours key sticker. These are so cute. I never want to use them, but also they're super cute. I want to use them. There's also these two fan art stickers. I assume they're of key because the whole bag was key. Here's with the lemon. Here's with the strawberry. This does look like key during Tokyo Dome, the first Tokyo Dome. That's like how he styled his hair. And it came with this coaster with the Keyland logo on it. Very cute. I have been using it. Um, and then they also came with this print I want to show you. I have it already in my binder, so that's why I'm showing it like this. This is actually from Lightsabers, um, who's a, a popular pin maker. Um, it says Happy Key Day. So yeah, that's everything from A Music and Level 5. It was a lot of stuff. I know, I'm really grateful. She did not have to do all this. Um, but I'm very, very, very grateful. And, you know, she added a lot of stuff to my collection, so I wanted to show that. Last gift to show, um, also very, very, very exciting item. It's from Shaw360, who's one of my first YouTube friend, I think. Um, I was surprised she um, remembered <laughs> and she sent me something. I was very, very surprised. Um, just because I haven't been very active um, anywhere <laughs> lately. I'm, I've kind of been like ghosting, coming up just to see... Um, like if I get messages, I'll go check on Instagram and Twitter, but I'm not really posting and retweeting much these days. Um, and then also on YouTube, I'm not really watching a lot of videos and I'm not commenting a lot, which is something I, I usually comment on every video I watch because just I like doing that. Um, but I haven't been doing any of that lately. Um, but she still thought of me and sent me this and I was really grateful. Um, 
so she sent me a shoulder Ida bag, <laughs> which is super cool, and it's like adjustable and everything. So it has this pocket here for me to put pins. So it comes, so it has like this, you put it here and then the back stay over here and they're protected so they don't fall out and get lost. Um, I've always wanted an Ida bag, but I've always been really picky about like actually getting one. I've always been like, is this the best one? Is this this? Is this this? But look at Sam. She did it all. <laughs> she did it for me because it's a shoulder bag and I don't know if she noticed, but when she came for the Super M concert as well, I had, sh I had two shoulder bags the two times the time we hung out I picked her up in a shoulder bag and then to the concert I took another shoulder bag um, so this is the kind of style of bag I would use daily um, and then I remember I wore pins to the Super M concert on my lanyard like I purposely wore my lanyard so I could have a way to display my pins because I didn't have any other way to display them and I think I remember her commenting about that like it'd be nice if I had a better way to display them um, so I think, I think she might have remembered that from November and bought me this, which is so sweet and so thoughtful. Um, and I think she did when I texted her, um, I mean, messaged her, thank you for this. I think she did say, now you have a good way to display them. And I was like, oh my gosh, yes. <laughs> I haven't actually done any decorating because I'm very indecisive. I don't know what I want to put in it. If I want to make it like a shiny bag or like a key bag or like a taming bag because his comeback is coming in July um, so I might want to make it a taming bag to show taming support I haven't gone out yet because of um, you know the um, pandemic my state is still not um, <laughs> still still doesn't have an okay so I haven't gone out I've gone out like once or twice so I wouldn't really be able to show it off but you know maybe by July I can show it off for taming month if you have any suggestions actually I gladly take them for how to decorate I'm kind of leaning towards a taming bag now though but yeah <laughs> I love this on the back it actually has a mesh pocket with a zipper so I could actually add more stuff here like buttons or something um, and on the inside it's just lined like this and it's actually very spacious I think this would be like the best concert bag because it's very spacious for like your portable charger the wires, your light stick, a light stick would probably stick out just a little bit in here. And it has one more pocket on the inside. It's just really, really nice. It has a lot of features I like, and it's black, which is ideal. All my bags, I think you can see, this is the bag I use every day when I go out. It's my Keyland official bag. Love it. Um, this is my normal, like, everyday bag. I take it to work, and I take it um, out. Um, so I like black bags, because they're, you know simple and you can like deck them out however you want so yeah this is just such an exciting item and I'm so excited I might start decorating soon I'm just like nervous <laughs> but um, I'm also really excited and I feel like because like with my pin um, display which is over there you can't see it but um, I'm constantly rearranging like everything because that's how I am I'm like that with the posters on my wall too constantly taking them down putting them back up to find a way because I suddenly don't I suddenly want a different aesthetic um, so, whatever I do first, it's not going to stay for long because I'm going to be like, now I want to do this. Like, now it just popped into my head. I could do Tame In for July and then Key in September, all my key pins for Key Month. So, yeah, I might be doing that. But, um, I'm just really happy with it. Happy with all the things I received. And again, thank you so much to the friends that thought of me, sent me things. And they're all so sweet and they didn't have to do any of this but I'm super super grateful you know um it's kind of weird for me still to receive things because I don't know I guess I'm still like I'm, I'm less shy than when I started my channel but I think I am still kind of shy with all my YouTube friends but um, I really shouldn't be because they send me stuff and I send them stuff and it's mutual you know this is a mutual I just love seeing you happy and smiling and I want to show you every single way I can so yeah um, yeah just yeah and thank you to all the people who messaged me on my birthday too. several other friends also messaged me and that was very very sweet I it warms my heart it warmed my heart all day when I got um, texts and messages from people saying happy birthday it means a lot to me that people remember 
um, I only tell people I'm close to my like, exact birthday only because they ask <laughs> and it means a lot to me that they remember and they message me and send me warm thoughts um, my birthday was fun um, it was you know in quarantine um, I don't know how but my mom got a cake for me <laughs> because a lot of places are closed down and um, my brother gifted me oh I, I didn't mention that my brother gifted me an Amazon gift card I was gonna show it too um, and with that I pre-ordered NCT 127's repack album yeah, I pre-ordered the A version because the A version had the concept I liked more. Really grateful because I'm trying to do a no-buy and failing. Um, and him gifting me that, I was able to get it with, you know, his money. <laughs> so that was really nice. And I did also get myself the Monster X Fantasia X album. I had pre-ordered that for myself in April, um, knowing it would come out in May as my own gift to myself. So um, that was also fun that I did that for me. Um, so yeah. That is it for this video. It's long and I'm sorry. Um, but like I said, I just wanted to share because I got a lot of cool stuff for my collection. I got shiny stuff, NCT stuff, Monster X stuff, Gangnanyo stuff. Like, amazing. <laughs> I'm so happy. 101 stuff, technically. I still, Daniel, you know, 101 is why I love him so much. Um, but yeah. Thank you so much for watching this video. Until my next one. Um, warning, I do have a lot of pre-recorded videos I've been posting. Um, I always put a disclaimer. Like, this was recorded a while ago. Um, but yeah. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Precious. So yeah. Goodbye. Thank you for watching.